Hello. Good evening. Good evening. How are you doing? I'm doing awesome. Thank you for asking. How are you doing? I'm fit as a fiddle. Okay. Thank you for asking. Yeah. Yes. Okay. So I guess we had a session before. Or is this the first time? Okay. Fine. It is first time. Uh, Okay, 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 fine. So as you know, I'm Monica and I'm basically from Kolkata. Can I know something about you? Yes, my name is Anand Sir. I'm basically mm -hmm. from Bihar and I'm a teacher. Right, okay. So, uh, so you're basically from Bihar. You have been born and brought up in Bihar or you relocated? Born and brought up in Bihar. So do you have any idea about the topic we are about to discuss today? I guess you know about session notes, right? Uh, yes, I know. Today, I think, yeah, it is planned. Yeah, right. So that is what I'm asking, whether you want to go with the session topic or you want to talk generally about other topics or other questions. No, we can talk about this topic plan. Okay, fine. Yes. So, yes, uh, right. Now, have you ever planned your life in detail? Like... Uh, do you prefer to make plans or not? No, I don't no. make plans. And uh, I don't plan for whole life because I enjoy in the moment. That's why I do not plan. Yeah, but definitely now you would ask me uh, that, yeah, I have to plan for certain things like financially. Everybody has to be good, found to lead a good life, right? So yes, I, I plan about it. But like, I'm not kind of person who is planning for whole life that, yeah, I'm going to do, I'm going to do this, that, you know, at that certain age. No, I don't have a plan. I have just planned to be in moment. Okay. Okay, fine. What about the next five years? I mean, everyone plans for at least in the coming three or five or 10 years about what we should be achieving in our, in our careers and we should be where should we be in investing our money and where should we be vacationing maybe? Do you have any such plans in your mind? Yeah, of course, I have one plan uh, and I think I must achieve it. That is, I should be financially free uh, within the next five, six years. Yeah, so that is one plan in my mind. Except it, I don't have any particular goal. Uh, but I have this goal and I know when once I will achieve this goal, I'm going to fulfill all my goals. Uh, because I will have ample amount of time to do whatever I want to do and what really matters in my life. Okay, okay, fine. So you want to be financially free, right? Yeah. By the next uh, five or ten years. What does it mean to be financially free? Uh, it, it does mean, you know, like uh, I should have ample amount of money uh, to do whatever I want to do. I need mean not uh, if I wanna. Uh, I'm not talking about something like you know. If I want to have my own private jet, no, I don't know about it whether it will be possible or not. I'm not talking about in that sense, you know. I'm just talking about I should have ample amount of money to have a good food, you know, to have good clothes and to have a good bungalow to live in, or not a bungalow at least simple home house right? Uh, I should have uh, enough money to visit some countries or places where I want to visit. Right, these kind of things uh, should be fulfilled, you know, from my money. Okay, yes, yes, right, sure. Now, do you often make impulse purchases, like, uh, or you're very careful when you're buying something? No, I, I think a lot when I'm uh, while I'm buying that stuff because you know uh, like if I'm buying something which is gonna be useless after some time I do not buy it yes I don't feel it like buying uh, even even if I'm buying the clothes I am like I have to look at everything like how long this cloth is going to run uh, you know uh, because I know, like, uh, I, I can have thousands of clothes, but I know on the other part of the world, people are without clothes, you know. So I have to look at everything. 
so i think about every stuff that i'm buying i'm buying those of stuff which is really essential in my life i'm not buying anything which is not essential which means you are thrifty when it comes to shopping right yeah okay right Pl- failing to plan is planning to fail what are your thoughts about this statement i i think uh, i think it is right like if you are planning definitely you are going to be failed because all the plans are not going to be according to you like a uh, reason is that uh, this universe is different and this universe is not run by you it is being run by this existence and uh, since time of immemorial so if you are planning that today like this should happen that should happen and it is not happening you would definitely get miserable without any like you know uh, you should not be miserable you should enjoy this like today i i thought it should not rain but it rained so i cannot control it and i had planned there should be no rain right i had planned to go out today but it rained and i cannot control it so i should have enjoyed the rain instead of you know thinking about the plan that had been destructed by the rain and destroyed by the rain right so i know planning is just most of the time if you are planning then it you are you are going to be fail and it it cause misery and most of the people are making misery out of it right now okay right okay now when you travel when you travel do you plan where you will go what you could eat right or where what where which places you would visit or you just prefer to teach a uh, take each day as it comes to you yeah i prefer to take each day as it comes to me right the uh, uh, when i'm going to visit if i have planned already you know if i have seen everything then what is what is importance of that visit right so if i'm going to the unknown places and totally in unknown circumstances then only i enjoy and i find it challenging and challenge gives me kind of you know uh, a strength so yes i enjoy everything just on its way okay now did you have any plans when you were younger but you had to give up on it as you grew up was there any such plan yeah of course everybody uh, has this these kind of plans right so i had also like uh, somebody uh, thinks about becoming a doctor but he couldn't right so like yeah i had also some plans but i think yeah it it i couldn't fulfill those uh, and i couldn't stick to those plans because of some greater reason right and greater good reason so i have to not worry yes but i would tell you yeah definitely it happened okay okay well uh, the one that we were discussing about um, failing to plan is planning to fail actually means where you are not planning about anything where you fail to plan something it means you are actually planning to fail in your life yeah. right so it means actually the other way around that you spoke about but anyways we'll go with another one now there is a person called john lennon right and he said life is what happens to you while you are busy making other plans what do you think he meant uh, he meant you know like uh, life would happen the way it should happen right so you cannot control it anyway so why are you making plans just just be uh, in the moment and enjoy the life uh, i think you know he wanted to say this like just don't plan whatever is coming in your way enjoy it and just face it with your full potential yeah that's what fine